Hello, I am Rudin HS and these are some videos what I made showing what I do with software. Okay, so triggering breaks is something I really like to do at gigs um, and when I'm composing as well. Um, and so I'm gonna sort of show you one way I do it. This track here, these blue clips, these are all loads and loads of different breaks. Um, and what I've done is I've set them all with a quantized value of 1 8th, which you can do by selecting a whole load of clips. And then when you've selected a whole load of clips, you can assign the same uh, adjustments to them, such as their quantized value or their stretch algorithm, etc., or what color they are, what they're called. So um, I've assigned all these clips to keys on my piano keyboard, um, which I've done by going to MIDI and uh, assigning, because these are groups, I've assigned them to the sort of group scene here. So they're all there. The, 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 the black keys on my keyboard will trigger snare drums. The white keys will trigger ki kick drums and a new loop. So I'm free to kind of like prat about it. Which is all very nice and fun. I've also set up a looper um, on that channel so that um, to avoid getting too carried away with all the breaks, I can just kind of uh, at will record like a two bar loop of what I'm doing and make a new drum break or a new beat out of it, which I'm gonna try now. which is cool. Um, I've also kind of uh, done that with these single hits um, using the looper to um, kind of create s actual drum loops from scratch. Uh, all these hits here are assigned to a 16th note. Um, so I'll try and do the same again. Not the best beat in the world, but you get the idea. 